see pretty girls. Wait, right? can you repeat that? There are actually far less genuinely, and I'm not talking about the guys who front, genuinely mm. high value men than there are pretty girls. You can go to any club in any country in the world. I've been to 72 countries. You can go to any club in any country in the world and see pretty girls. If you're going to find a young, in shape, smart, tall, intelligent, rich man, it's extremely difficult to find. And that man has options. He has more options than a beautiful girl. And I'll tell you something what a high value man respects. When he meets a girl that's genuinely ride or die, as in, he, I'm with this man, I like this man, this man loves me, I love him. He fucked that bitch, but it doesn't matter because he came home to me. Right. That man has choices. Why would he choose a girl who thinks, oh, if he sleeps with another girl, I'll go sleep with some dude. He just, he'll just ignore you. He won't be with you. You're not going to have the best of the best if you're going to think that way. The only what you girl, don't know won't hurt you, right? Say again? What you don't know won't hurt he you, He right? will know. He'll smell it because he's a bad boy like me. He'll smell it. But I know okay. something ain't right. Something ain't right. And I'm telling you, this is the way the world works. And I'm not saying it's I easy. I like you. I don't, thank you. And I'm not, saying, <laughs> I'm not saying it's easy for a woman, right? I understand it can be heartbreaking. I can understand it can be difficult. Mm. But it's not easy, but it's a competitive environment, right? Why so, would you do that to the woman you love? Because, listen, you know. let me tell you something about the He has the options, that's why. No, it's not that. There's no joy without pain. There's no sunshine without rain. You need up and down. This is how the world works. Make her cry, make her cry, make her cry a little bit. That's Take her to the Maldives. Oh One, two, bang. This is what makes life fun. You can't be sitting there all day. You could get the, I'm telling you, you could get the most high value man in the world who ticks every single box. If he has no hoes and he's home with you every day watching Netflix, you're gonna get bored of him anyway. Mm -hmm. Facts. It, so yeah. don't yeah. Lie. Yeah. Yeah. Can we Mr. fuck them together? Tate doesn't believe that. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I mean, I agree and disagree because I prefer loyalty over anything, but this day and age, that doesn't exist. As exactly. you said, you visited exactly. 78 countries. That doesn't happen in other countries at all. Women are nothing in other countries. Like you said, U.S. 72. 72. 72. <laughs> well, sorry. <laughs> 72. Okay. But, um, yeah, it just, yeah, no, girls don't have any type of rights when it comes to that. So United States is the only way like that. That's just the reality of it. So you either take it and leave it. If you want a high-valued man, as you said, that's just how it goes. So that's okay, so what think. about okay? So what about to change the what about to change the question? Right. Mm -hmm. Let's assume that every single high-value man across a ten-year span at some point mm -hmm. is gonna fuck another girl. Okay, yeah. Would you do you want him to lie to you or tell or tell you the truth? Tell me the tell truth. truth. So you want him to tell you the truth so you can go out there and fuck some idiot, some no some yes. in the mean, club, some some dwarf. We're even, right? No, we're not even. Yep. No, we're not. That's absolutely no, not no, even. You no you've been with a high, you've been with a guy for three years who's been taking care of you. You're you're a couple who's ah, been paying the bills, yeah. looking after you. He slept with some idiot girl he doesn't care about anymore, and you're gonna go bang fucking but Pedro with no money in the bank. To be but what is it? Now you're homeless. But what what did Pedro blew my bank out? <laughs> okay, Jane. No, no, Jane. no, no, no. Who cares? Next <laughs> question. I have a quick Next question. question. Next question. <laughs> um, okay. For the men, what do you guys consider a high-valued man? Is it looks? Is it money? Or is it both? Or, well, I mean, what's your opinion on that? I'm just curious on what you as guys, as a man, man, thinks a high-value man is. Mm -hmm. You want to go first, CEO, or me? Uh, you can go first. You know what I truly think a high value man is? Mm -hmm. A high value man is, is doing something which nearly, okay, it's a few things, right? So mm -hmm. there's there's the obvious evolutionary triggers. Right. The easiest way to be a high value man is a man who's capable of violence. If we look at it from a biological trigger, it doesn't matter if he's got muscles or he's big or he's tall, or whatever. Women understand from a biological perspective, they like a man who can fight. Yeah. It doesn't matter if your man had money, a Ferrari, everything, but if you knew for a fact, if any dude stepped to him, he'd get sparked, you wouldn't want him. Right, so that's the first thing. No, but no, yeah. yeah, you need a man who could fight. But but really, truly, to answer your question, I think that the true value of a high, the true marker of a high, high value man is a man who could say no to pussy. And I mean this on a genuine level. Mm, Here's yeah. the problem. Yes. Here's the problem. You girls don't understand. All the lower level dudes, you say, I don't want a high value man who cheats. Da da da. If you got a lower value guy, he'll cheat up with anybody. He'll fuck anything. Period. He has he has no choice. If you get a high value guy, at least he has the option to say no to something. 